Yeah. What's up, what's up, peoples? I like that right there. Mm. Yeah, man, that's another one done up by my mans and them fuzzy slippers, man. You already know who this is. Well, some of y'all that don't know. It's a new show out here, so you know, it's a lot of people that don't know me, but that's going to change soon, hopefully. But this is the Untitled Black Talk Radio Show with your boy Michelangelo Black, and I'm going to get right into it, all right? We're going to talk about women on the down low. Yeah, that's right. We're going to talk about women out here on the down low. Now, I don't know how many brothers out there have dated women, you know, that are dealing with their sexuality. You know what I'm saying? But I think it's a... um. It's, it's an issue that need to be spoke on, man I know, you know, a few people talk about it But it's not as big as, I guess, the, you know, the male down low phenomenon You know, out here with all these black men Now, especially in Atlanta, where I live And, you know, you got a lot of gay people out here, men and women And you have a lot of women who kind of hide their sexuality they don't want to come fully out of the closet. So they date men to cover it up. And speaking from personal experience, now I'm not sure if the chick that I was dating, I'm not sure if she was still, you know, gay or bi, whatever the fuck. I don't know. <laughs> but. She's told me that she, you know, had a few experiences with women, you know, or, you know, girls or whatever, same sex. Back in the day, you know, teenager, you know, young and dumb, you know, doing little shit, messing around or whatever. So, you know, I was cool with it, you know. I was like, all right, whatever, you did that in the past, whatever. It's like, you know, how many women went to college and ate some pussy, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and, you know, after college, you know, they got married and, you know, it was all good. You know what I'm saying? My whole thing is be honest about about the shit. You know what I mean? If you still like women, just, you know, be honest with the dude you getting to know. Yeah, it might scare him away. Then again, it might not scare him away. You know what I'm saying? If you just keep the shit real I think that, that'll that save a lot of headaches You know, a lot of <laughs> A lot of A lot of stress You know Because you, you don't want your mans, you know, wondering You know, like, damn, like, is this chick Like like myself, like, what I had to go through Was like, I had to wonder kind of like Yeah, like her Her whole crew is Former lesbians you know what I'm saying? If your chick, if your chick is hanging around a bunch of saved lesbians or used to be lesbians, then your chick is probably still gay, my dude. I'm just go ahead and just break it to you like that, man, cause uh, <laughs> it's like, yo, I mean, used to be gay. I don't know. I mean, if you gay, you gay. You know, if you like chicks, you know, if you like other dudes. If you a dude yourself, then, you know, just be honest about your shit, man. You know? You know, you gotta... Even with the gay movement, how it is now, you still got a lot of people who are, you know, terrified to come out and, you know, and admit that they're gay. Because, you know, it's still... It's still gonna be some type of backlash, you know, maybe from family members or, you know... Maybe their, their spouse, they don't want to lose, you know, they, their girlfriend or they don't want to lose their boyfriend or whatever the case might be. Or, you know, you're trying to please your parents, you know, you're trying to please your father. You know, your father could be a minister or your, something like that. And you don't want to come out that, you know, you're a homosexual when your father's against homosexuality. Hmm. So I mean <laughs> I just think the the 
the women who are on the down low. I just think, you know, I think it's kind of worse because by nature, you know, it's almost like women are bisexual anyway, you know, by nature. And I say that because it's like, not that they're bisexual, really, but it's like girls get naked in front of, in front of each other, you know. Girls compliment each other. Oh, look at her booty. Oh, she's cute. Or, oh, you know, they, they play. They sit on each other's lap. They grab each other's booty and shit like that. And it's considered normal. Like, people look at that as normal behavior. Like, oh, those are just girls being girls. So it's almost like they're kind of by by nature. And it's not looked upon as anything else as you know just being playful as you know like if a dude is you know grabbing on this nigga's ass and all this type of shit it's like damn nigga like why are you grabbing my ass like that's kind of gay dude you know what i mean like why are you slapping me on the ass nigga we not on the basketball court nigga like that's the only place where it's acceptable like on the basketball court football field baseball shit like that you know you pat you know tap the nigga on the ass make a good play with the back of the hand or whatever, you know. <laughs> but women, they they do that type of shit, you know. They go to the bathroom together, you know. They, you know, if they got something going on, they, you know, expect, you know, um, they check out each other's titties and shit. Like, girl, I, I, I thought I had a lump right here, you know. Check my titty and, you know, they do all that type of shit together. You, you know, you don't see a group of men looking at each other's dicks and shit. You know what I'm saying? It just don't happen. We just don't have that relationship with our homies. But women do. And so, you know, some girls go to college. You know, they get a little tipsy. They get, you know, get a little dizzy. And, you know, they end up sucking on some pussy. I'm just saying, ain't nothing wrong with that. But they don't consider themselves to be gay or bi. Like, yeah, I licked, a, I licked a few boxes back in the day, but I'm not gay. I'm not bi. Huh? Let a nigga be like, oh, yeah, you know, <laughs> I sucked a couple dicks in college. You know what I'm saying? I'm just experimenting. Like, get the fuck out of here. Like, you gay. But I'm saying there's nothing wrong with being gay. I'm just saying you, you can't have people out here falling in love with you and you getting serious with people and you're dealing with your sexuality i mean that goes for men and women but of course we know all about the the you know man being on the down low we know we, we know all about that phenomenon but these women out here on this down low shit i don't know man y'all need to just go ahead and come on out the closet man all the way out the closet and you know like i said like i've dated you know a chick or two you know who you know battle with their sexuality and it's nothing cool about that at all you know what i'm saying like i don't wish that shit on on nobody you know to be sitting around you know wondering if your your chick is still you know into girls or not you know what i mean so i would just you know advise niggas to not even do it like if you know your chick has messed around with other women back in the day um and if you're not really into that you know i would suggest that you not date her you know her <laughs> you know what i'm saying if you can't handle a bisexual woman just don't date her it's, you know it's just that simple it might seem intriguing at first like yo damn like yeah my chick is into other chicks you know what i'm saying get this three-way popping you know what i'm saying but at the end of the day if you're not really into that type of shit and you're not the type of nigga that can handle that stay away from it bro i'm just just telling you man like me my whole thing was was you know it's, it's about honesty with me like if you into other chicks you know just keep it real and you know that could have been at least one thing we had in common you know but man i'm gonna go ahead and get out of here <laughs> you know what i'm saying um follow me on twitter um michelangelo black hit me up on facebook matter of fact just google me m-i-c-h-a-e-l 
I know because some of y'all don't know how to spell Michael. Um, it's not Michelle, it's Michael. Um, that's Michael Angelo Black, B L A K. Just Google me, follow me on Twitter. I'm on Facebook, all that good stuff, all right? Yo, Fuzzy, man, fade me out. <laughs>